Okay, so we're having a little look today at the headlining lights in the back of the Discovery 3. I think they're the same in the 4. Have we had a look in the back of the Disco? We haven't checked yet. We haven't checked yet. Um, now, they, they come in three parts, as you can see, and we've had a customer who's changed his LED bulb. You can see we've got the LED bulb fitted in there, and it all sort of exploded on him or something. I'm not quite sure. Um, but basically, the headlining in is sandwiched, let me put that bit down, is sandwiched between this metal plate and this little plastic frame, okay? And it's got these little hooks, there's a little sort of, if you can see on there, there's a little sort of, so it goes down that little ramp and then hooks in. So that sandwiches that like so. Um, and then, when that's all in place, yeah, um, this part just pops into place in there and clips into the frame. Okay, so I'm just having a little work of this out. I guess that that metal bit there wants to be in line with to reflect the heat, doesn't it? I guess. Yeah. So that when you put it back, I think that needs to go there. Um, anything else? I guess this that will just plastic bit's got a notch. Is that, has that one got? End. Oh, it's got a little. Good ah, yeah, it's got back. those two little notches there. Yeah, yeah. Can you see that by my finger there? There you go. Uh, and the, at the very the, end of it, there's a little cut out. To get the screws okay, in. but let's just have a look. So it, it way around. So it goes the other way around, yeah, because you can't fit it because those little tabs fit in the gap there, yeah. So it is, it is sided. So if I look at the other side, so the switch is nearer the back seat. So the switch needs to go. Um, the switch is at which side? Hold on, the light is at that side. The switch so, goes towards the front of the car. So the switch, yep. Yeah, so the bulb is at the back, the switch is at the front, yeah. So that needs to go in the back that way round, okay? So it's hard to see. We've we got no battery in the disco at the moment. So there's the wire poking down there. We need to keep hold of him. So that plate is just gonna we're just gonna feed him up through in there. Alright, and then he literally rests there. There's nothing to clip him in place as far as I can work out. Right then. Oh, he's fighting me a little bit. Right, and, and then we got to get that little plastic frame and squidge him in. Now, the way I took this out actually was a little bit different. I mean, I'm going to try something because that's going to be a bit fiddly. I'm making this up as I go along. What I did on when I took it out was let's get there. So let's get it the right way round again. I flip the plastic. Flip that plastic round. Now what I did was I had the back. I actually had the back clipped in. All right, like that, and then. And then what I did was I slipped it in, so the bulb is going to to that way. So I'm going to try and start it off like that, and then there's enough room to to get that in. Look, and hopefully you don't break the clip. Oh yeah. Right, go on. Oh, I've got that stuck bit. I didn't do that very well. Make sure I get the get that metal bit inside. No, you've gone too far. Not too far. far. That plastic as well. I think you might come round. You might come round, look. Uh, oh, yeah, I've got to get that back one. That's it. That's it. Right. Push on the metal bit. Oh. Right there. Ah, there you go. Look. And then I've just got to clip that back edge in, then, haven't I? one's in. That one's in. There you go. That's the better way of doing that. That's a bit of a fiddle. Now I've got to fish the cable. Now I've got to fish the cable out. Here he is. Here he is. That's not shouldn't be too hard to find. Right there. There you go. Put that in. And then... Put that in. Done. There you go. I hope that helps someone.